Major U.S. airlines say they will ask passengers on flights to the United States for information that public health officials could use for contact uh, COVID-19 contact tracing. Under the plan, the seven U.S.-based airlines said they will begin collecting information from travelers on U.S.-bound flights. The airlines will ask international passengers for names, phone numbers, and email and home addresses, but it will be strictly voluntary. The carriers will then turn over the information to the Centers for Disease Control and Prevention. Home prices skyrocketed more than 10 percent in December. According to the Case-Shiller Home Price Index, prices increased 10.4 percent. That's the fastest pace in seven years. Phoenix, Seattle and San Diego continued to show the strongest price gains among the 19 cities surveyed. Home prices began to see big gains last summer as COVID-driven demand descended on the housing market. Record low supply combined with record low mortgage rates caused bidding wars on homes across the nation. Dairy Queen is canceling its annual free cone day for the second year in a row because of the pandemic. Dairy Queen says it was a difficult decision, but that it's looking forward to bringing back free cone day in 2022. The fast food chain traditionally gives out free soft serve cones every year to mark the first day of spring. Up next, if you've been using a certain device at home to check your blood oxygen levels, you may not be getting a correct reading. That's next. Maybe.